think the law, especially economic law, was designed in order to sustain growth. And, and that was the, the objective of the post uh, uh, World War and definitely in the golden uh, 60s. So I think we have a law which is still uh, probably um, made up uh, on the basis of this objective. And now we have other objectives. Uh, that, and that's my, my first three marks. Those objectives uh, we have experienced today are not well de defined. So there is a lot uh, to do and a lot to research, and, and that's for you, obviously, uh, for all the young researchers here. First, how do we get from smart devices to the Internet of Things? Second, how exactly does the Internet of Things impact sustainability? And third, is the Internet of Things a game changer for sustainability? This vagueness can be used um, for environmental uh, justice movements, for interpreting the situation like the law more ambitiously to address environmental inequalities that um, are caused by certain environmental issues. Actually, the fight against premature obsolescence and decreasing uh, lifetime of products is part of this um, of strategies uh, towards sustainable development. Uh, the concerns that are uh, integrated into tax law, which I divided into environmental, social, and economic, and um, these two aspects enable me to highlight how sustainability is integrated into tax law and to what extent uh, tax law may or may not play a role um, in this transition. Yeah, that's very interesting what you say because it means that there is not only the, the two parts to the contract, the consumer and the producer, there is a third part, mm -hmm. which is the community and the future generation. That's very interesting. Culture, heritage and sustainable development to con for the conservation of resources for future generations contribute to a more democratic corporate governance to a more sustainable development. My main field of expertise is environmental taxation, so the use of taxation to achieve certain regulatory objectives, in particular the protection of the environment. What I tend to do is to show how a taxation can contribute to sustainable uh, development um, in general, but uh, especially from an uh, extractive industry uh, perspective. How to assess the sustainability of a set of legal rules as part of an evaluative or normative legal research question. As scientists, as jurists, we have no choice but to commit um, to improving the understanding of these issues and to uh, contribute to finding solutions.